we're actually homeowners. We can pick up the keys. Hey! Oh look, we've got posts. We're going to collect the moving van. First load. <sighs> so exciting. homeowners okay so hello welcome to key day this is annoying me hang on so today we are collecting the keys for our very first house and it is only quarter past 10 in the morning and we've actually just received a phone call from our solicitors so i'm gonna just insert those clips now oh amazing that's great that's really early thank you hi no worries have a nice day thanks bye It's not even, it's only just 10 o'clock and I've just had the call. Hello? Well, Dad? Yeah? Mom? Yeah? We can pick up the keys. <gasps> wow! <Yay! laughs> not even got me my scar on. <laughs> Hooray! I know, we're literally five past 10. What the fuck? <laughs> they probably want me off their back. Get her out of our hair. Oh, baby, we're Homeowners. I know, I've not even started the vlog yet. I was just getting ready, just chilling. We got a house. We got a house. What? What the hell? That phone call was so anticlimactic. <laughs> oh my god, mum. Hopefully when like the developers ring us, it's more exciting. As in like, they'll be excited. No, I think the solicitors have just done your supposed to get rid of you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's because I've been bugging them for so long. <laughs> yeah. So proud of you. Yay! How the hard work begins. <sighs> now I've got to move everything. <laughs> so yeah, I'd not even started the vlog. I was literally getting ready. We were told about midday, uh, but I think, I mean you heard my mum say, I think at this point my solicitors are probably trying to get me off their back because I've been bugging them to make sure they get things done. As you've obviously, if you've watched the whole journey of the move, you will have seen if you haven't watched the whole journey i'll put a playlist on screen in the description but we can officially go and collect the keys so we've had a call from our solicitors i'm expecting a call i presume from the developers just to confirm that we can actually go and get the keys because obviously it would we'll be going to their office but uh, it's so exciting i was like really not expecting it to happen this soon i'm sweating i'm like never sweating I think, okay, so like I'm like 95% happy and 5% can we actually? I feel like someone's tricking me. Like I did not expect it to happen this soon. So I think as soon as the developers ring me, I'm gonna be absolutely off me head. But yeah, today is the most exciting day of our lives. I'm so excited for this new chapter together. Today, basically my boyfriend's family are coming. My grandma is joining me, my parents and we're all gonna go get the keys, look around the house. We're gonna do our snags because we get seven days to snag the house which is like any defects or anything we're gonna like enjoy it probably go to the pub over the road for our first drink as homeowners and yeah just like soak it all up and then tomorrow we're actually moving we've got the moving van booked there's a lot of things i'm gonna insert a clip because we actually received delivery of a sofa so this is the moving in present from my parents originally we were gonna wait we weren't gonna order it like now because obviously it's september it's not warm but our actual living room sofa is delayed so we've ordered the garden sofa a lot earlier than expected so at least we've got something to sit on in the living room so it's gonna be like a indoor sofa for a little bit but that arrived it looks huge as you can see the garage is very full at this point uh, but yeah, it's currently quarter past ten. Uh, I think I might ring my grandma actually and let my grandma know. Hello, honey Hello, good morning, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, girl. You sound quite cheerful with your sound, so is it got it all sorted? Yeah, I've just had a phone call saying we can go and collect our keys. Oh, amazing, Lou, oh my god. I know. <laughs> take a deep breath, take a deep breath. I've already made my dad cry this morning. I've got, I've got my lucky turn, so I'm taking granddad with us. Oh, brilliant, absolutely brilliant. Look who's here. Hello, 
Hello! It's been so long Hello. since you've seen her. We're gonna collect uh, the keys. <laughs> Uh, big big day for me and my gorgeous gorgeous granddaughter. <laughs> I'm so gorgeous, excited. Gorgeous, yeah. You've not even seen the house, have you? So no, it's all new. From was reading the card that I made mum and dad cry with earlier. Mm. Mum, it's there. Hello. Hello, is that Alice? It is. Hello, are you okay? I'm all right. I'm very fidgety, but I'm all right. <laughs> it's everything's gone through. Amazing. Yeah. Amazing. Yeah, it's all, it's Yours. Turn the turn the key, ready. Hey! 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 Oh look, we've got posts. You can have um, takeaway tomorrow. Oh yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah. Can yeah. Have tomorrow, yeah. 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 That's their buzz from me. Oh, oh, really oh, you. Oh, wishing you, yeah, please, wishing you please, happiness please, and good Wi-Fi in your new house. <laughs> We are in the house. It's officially our house. I forgot my camera, so I came back for you guys because I didn't want to leave you on the side. We're just gonna go up to the pub, grab some lunch, and then everyone from Sheffield's gonna go home, pack up their van ready for tomorrow, and then, yeah, tomorrow is moving day. It feels so weird. We've been going around sticking sticky notes on things. Like we've got some snags that we've taken note of. So when you see the house tour, there will be sticky notes everywhere, but just picture me vlogging and this is the view. How weird. This is gonna be my vlog angle from now on. Do you know like resting it on here, doing the bots? Yeah. Washing, doing cooking. <laughs> I'm just gonna try that live. Okay. Oh. All right, I'm not gonna show you too much because I'm not sure when the house tour is going up, but. All right, oh, let's just close this door. It's now four o'clock. Um, everyone's gone home. I can't remember what I've filmed at this point. Me and mum have just filmed the house tour. So have a look for that on my channel. I'm not sure when this video is going up, but hopefully that'll be up. I'm now laid in the bedroom. We're just waiting for my dad to come back. He's gone to collect the mattress. So it's got time to like rise because obviously it's, it's like vacuum packed. Oh, I can't breathe, I've just walked up the stairs and out of breath. What am I going to be like tomorrow when I've actually got to move loads of boxes? <laughs> He's gone to get the mattress. He's gone to get the box of like tea bags and cups and stuff that we'll need whilst we're moving tomorrow. And then we've also had a delivery of paving slabs for the garden. So he's gone for, I'm presuming, I'm hoping a wheelbarrow so we can move the paving slabs off the drive and put them in the garden. Just said to my boyfriend that it just feels like I'm dreaming. I feel like I'm like seeing things through someone else's eyes. Like I don't think gonna set in for a while. I feel like tonight's gonna be sad because obviously it's the last night with my parents, but also tomorrow is gonna be insane because everyone's here helping us move. Everything's coming in, all the furniture that we've been collecting for the past year. It's all gonna be in here. Maybe when like things are in here, it'll feel more like home. I think when the kitchen has been unpacked, we'll feel good but yeah very surreal at the minute i'm just really excited to soak it all up <sighs> i should have filmed us getting upstairs oh, of course my battery starts dying we're going to collect bye, bye mum we're going to collect the moving van from hexthorpe we have the van Dad's just changing the mirrors. I could drive this van, but I do not want to drive this van. Um, so Dad is the man for the job. And yeah, we've just paid the rest of the money. We get some deposit back once we've uh, dropped it off. And I've had a really good experience with these guys actually. So if you are like local, can you see the mirror? Sorry. If you're local and you need a van, so far I definitely recommend these guys but we are meeting my boyfriend and his family back at our house so they can help us unload well load and unload uh, all those boxes in our conservatory so yeah i thought it was better sending them our way 
because then at least we've got more pairs of hands because there's a lot like we've got the majority of like the kitchen things and like the furniture so the more hands the better let's do it planning is coming to coming to life first load right it didn't take long for me to put my hair up but the first load is in the van uh we actually did that so quickly we picked the van up at like nine o'clock got back to ours at maybe like 20 past and it is now half past 10, so we did that super quick, which was so good, thanks to everyone's help. So we're just driving to the house now, and then we've got the fun of trying to work out where to put everything. <laughs> but I'm just gonna take it as it comes. I've got my keys, how surreal. I've got house keys, and my boyfriend's following along in his mum's car. Oh, I hope someone's ringing me. is what we are looking like everyone's done so well it's currently half 11 so we've made really good time the bin is in all this in the living room i've been stood on the back of the van so i'm not actually sure what everything looks like so let's have a look oh my god it looks so different already just having boxes in here bathroom bedroom overflow <laughs> so much so glad everyone's come to help so thankful for them and then we're building wardrobes in here tomorrow so we've tried to keep this quite clear oh i'm bright red very sweaty we're all a bit hungry i think so i don't know we're gonna regroup for a second <sighs> nice. this is huge I'm kind of nervous to sit on the bed because I'm probably mucky, but we have a mattress in our bedroom. We've put a camera up on the outside of the house. Um, it was a bit of a palaver. Actually, it was a lot of a palaver, but it's up and it's working, so that's good. Um, everyone's sort of around doing bits. Mum and Dad are building our temporary sofa downstairs. And then everyone else is in the garden. And I'm going to move the bedside tables into place because they're behind me. And then we're going to make the bed. Um, I need to find the mattress protector but annoyingly we just opened the bed frame and there's a really big damage on it you can see it's propped up there it's been split but obviously I'm filming this on a Saturday and it's 4 p.m. so I like I'm on hold my phone's on hold here but obviously they've finished work but I'm gonna wait until because it's still counting down as if you can stay on the phone you know so I'm just just waiting <laughs> um hopefully we can figure it out but it's a bit frustrating but oh well at least the mattress is in there's a little bit of a scuff on it there i have to like spot clean that but for now i'm just gonna put the mattress cover on so we've got somewhere to sleep tonight it fits in here really nice actually i thought it was gonna feel too big but i mean obviously this is all end up here but there's actually quite a lot of room which is nice so hopefully hopefully when they want us to sort the bed frame out they just replaced that one piece because it came in like four boxes and we've only just discovered that one part of it was broken so yeah i don't really want to be trying to get everything back in its box you know so hopefully they'll do something about this but in the meantime i'm gonna put these where they need to go It is the next day. We had our first night's sleep in the house. 
I'm going to use the word sleep lightly because I couldn't switch my brain off. I think it's because we'd had such like a active, like amazing day. Like I wasn't unsettled. I just, my brain just wouldn't stop reliving everything. So I've had about three hours sleep. <laughs> but yeah, we had to wake up at half six for the IKEA delivery people. And I think they're arriving now. I can hear reverse bleepers, which I'm sure our neighbours are very grateful for. I think it's about... 10 past seven now so yeah at least it's coming i think it's the doors to the wardrobe and we're actually building those today so it is really helpful was well, the early wake up call for your first morning it's so nice looking out this window it's like lovely clear blue skies at the minute and the mattress is incredible we're gonna like sort the bed today so hopefully to tonight we'll be able to sleep on an actual bed frame but i mean it's actually really cozy and cute down here on the mattress so yeah, I'm also starting to lose my voice. <clears throat> I think it's because for the past few days I've spoke more than I've probably spoken in the past three months. <laughs> um, my introverted self isn't used to this life, but I'm actually really enjoying it. I'm gonna go downstairs and potter. Oh my God, I get to do that now I have a house. I'm just pottering. <laughs> Fraser's is getting worse. Um, we've been on some errands since I last spoke to you. I've organised my sink. We're just waiting on unpacking a box that's got like little containers in. Then I'll show you it. I'm sure it's thrilling. I'm actually really excited about it. When we show you the before and after, it is actually really good. We're all very impressed with ourselves. But me and mum have just started building like a little bathroom medicine cabinet. And it's got bits missing. But we bought it that long ago. We can't return it. I checked all the pieces, but obviously I didn't open the box with all the screws in. I wasn't going to get that far. And it's missing 24 screws. So as I'm sure you can imagine, we can't finish building that, which is very annoying. But we do have a cabinet in the bathroom that we've just got from Argos. So we're going to try and build that across our fingers. Um, and also, I've got some friends coming around soon, so I'm going to give them a very um, chaotic house tour, I'm sure. But I'm excited to see them. I think it's like half five now maybe six everyone's gone so my friends arrived we've actually built the sofa thing downstairs in fact let me show you i'm about to go in the shower but i want to actually remember to talk to you because i'm excited to document this so progress so i've found the baskets for this we've still not like to it up yet because i need to find an extension lead but we've got those we've got some flowers how cute um in here we have the garden sofa built, ready for our temporary solution. And we've moved these Billy bookcase boxes up here because this is where they will go. So it makes more sense them sort of being behind the door. I'd say that you can't notice them, but I mean, there's a lot of other stuff to notice, but it doesn't matter. Um, but yeah, I think once we've hoovered, because there's a bit of fluff everywhere, maybe we'll put the coffee table in the center and then we'll feel like it's a bit more of a room. We've not shoved anything up and it's resting on some carpet so it doesn't damage the floor, but it's a good temporary solution. It's better than a deck chair, I guess. And then kitchen, we spun the table around earlier. So we've just got that, it's all been moved, but the plant's in its place, the table's in its place, the alcohol has been emptied out, very important. And things are looking a little bit neater. Uh, I actually got these mats from B&M, they're like sink mats, it stops them from getting scratched. And everyone really likes them, who's seen them. Um, but yeah, this is how we're looking so far. I love how the sun comes in at this time of day. What time is it? Oh my god, it's half six, not half five. Oh dear. Definitely food time soon. But yeah, charging a drill, cleaning the oven. <laughs> um, and we've got a gusto to cook. I think I'm going to end the vlog here. I don't even know at this point what this vlog entails but i'm gonna start a new vlog probably like more of like a weekly couple of days sort of thing because whilst everyone's here it's not like my instinct to pick up the camera it's easy for me to do time lapse and be in the moment and i'd rather it be like that so yeah i hope you've enjoyed the moving in vlog and key day and everything like that it's been so exciting can you believe that this is now my new vlog background this is my life i can't believe it quite yet i'm still boyfriend's hoovering i'm still um 
feeling like it's a bit of a dream so yeah I don't think it's gonna sink in yet I feel like I'm just living in someone else's body at this point so weird but yeah thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one bye